preferably eight and a half, 11 by 8 and a half inches. What you would do is fold it in half and then crease it well and, and then unfold it and then you would tear it in half. Well, I have already done that. You would have it lengthwise and then fold it lengthwise. Now neatness is nece neatness is very necessary in this model. So if you want it to come back to you, you will need to be very neat, obviously. So I said it already like ten times. So you have to make sure you, sure these these creases are are pretty much exact. Make sure that they're that when you fold it in half, you have to make sure the edges are not off. If they're off by a little bit, that's good. But if it's it's okay. But if it's off by a lot, then it won't it won't come back. So what you do is fold the edges, the sides, towards the center, towards the middle crease. Now you might want to leave about like a, you want to leave a small amount between between the um, the edges and the crease be uh, small because when you fold it in half it will it will interfere so make make sure the crease is be the edges beside the crease not on it so as you can see as you can probably see sorry oh my god i did leave a little bit of space cuz the crease I did leave a little bit of space. So what you want to do, do that with the other side. If you, if you need if you need to, you can unfold this side. Sorry about dropping my camera. Now again, you also don't want to leave too much space. So you might want to leave about a millimeter, a millimeter of space, maybe a little bit bigger, but not too much. So after that, you fold it in half, this lengthwise again. Get that crease very, get that crease better, and unfold it, and then fold it halfway, width wide. Now you may have to just just um pull it pull this right here make it wrap make it more round and so you can flatten it Sorry. so you can flatten it and then and then um now what you want to do is Give this tip right here, fold it towards that center crease. Now you might want to, you might want to hold the bottom because it will like, it will move the paper, and you don't want that, or else it won't, or else it won't come back to you. Shut up. Okay, so fold the edges to that towards that middle crease, and do that with both sides. And then you might get that crease well. And then flip it over and do the same. Hold it towards the middle. And then fold it. And you will tuck these corners in. What you need to do is just open this and push that. And push that corner in. So open it and push that corner in. Oh my god, I may have messed up. Oh. Okay, and then the crease as well. And then unfold it. Now, 
right here. If you if you throw it if you if you're gonna throw it with your right hand, open the right side. But if you're gonna throw it with your left hand, you open the left side. So what you wanna do is right here, fold this crease right here, fold it very good, and then open it and flip it. Now these creases right here, which make the square, you want to make these better. They aren't already at best. Okay, now after you've done that, flip it over. Make sure the part that you open is on the right. So what you want to do is just close the top, the top half from from this square, and then try to have this this crease right here sticking out a little bit. So that's good. And then right here, as you can see, it's kind of like a triangle. Push this, push the top of the triangle down like that, and then. And then you have and then you have something like wait and then you have um like okay this is not good and then you have this here now what you want to do is fold fold this part that's sticking up fold it down and then let's do this here and then unfold it again and fold it again fold it down again you see this part right here instead of it being inside it's going to come out along this crease that should have been made and then you have that there now you unfold it again and this part you can un you can open this part and right here th this flap of paper will go in this pocket so this is easier to do with the pencil tip if your if the tip isn't going in if it's rolling up and then you're pretty much finished you're almost finished all you need to do is interlock is lock the the the, corn, the edges or whatever so what you do is open it and fold it towards the center crease the edges And then open it up, and then it's a, and then sink the tip in one of them, and just one side, and then open it, open one, open the other side, fold it back in half, and then right here, you slide this into that little pocket. And then with the other side. Now, right here, it is normal for it to only have one layer, so don't so don't worry. If, 